Yo, how's it going everyone? My name is Jay Fatty. Welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can pretty much make any sample work with any tempo, okay? I say pretty much because it doesn't always work, but most of the time it does. And you have to have the newest FL Studio 20.7.2, I think it is. Um, I'll have the link down below because it's using something that they added on their new time plugin or whatever, so... Here, let me just find a melody that I'm fucking with. Shout out to the homie Sam Will. You can check him out. Uh, he sent out this melody pack for free, and it's fire. So let me just find one that I'm fucking with in the moment. I think I like this one. All of those I played are fire, though. Seriously, check this dude out. But uh, Okay, so you see that this tempo for this melody is set to 130 BPM, but my master tempo is at 100, and I want to stay there. So I could normally come in here and chop this up, chop all the transients and do all that bullshit, or I could just have uh, a computer do it for me, pretty much. So I'm going to right-click this, and I'm going to go to Time Warp Sample. And then you see right here, uh, underneath tempo, it says 129.782. That's the tempo, ugh, tempo, that's the tempo of the sample, okay? It's at 130, that's pretty much 130, so we're good. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hit this little sync button right here. And it's going to sync that sample to the 100 BPM. And most of the time, it gets it all pretty right. So I'm going to use this little uh, tool that has the cursor and a little document, and I'm going to drag it. We'll see here. You see it has it stretched out to um, 16 bars to fit the tempo. So let's see how it sounds with 100 BPM. You see how that's perfect with the tempo? Uh, tempo. I keep saying tempo. That's perfect with the tempo. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's amazing. Here, let me pull the original sample back in so you can hear. See, that doesn't go together. It doesn't sound right. Pretty cool. Now, that's just a little thing that you can do, and then you can now you can go in and start flipping it and messing with it. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to chop it up. And then I'm going to put some drums on it. And uh, yeah, we'll be back for that part, guys.
Okay, guys, here we go. I finally got this beat done. Um, yeah, this shit's crazy, all right? Shout out Sam Well and his, his melodies. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do it exactly. I'll probably have, like, a little fast-forward part for the part uh, that I, how I, when I made the beat. And then, um, yeah, I'm just going to let you hear what I made out of this. It's, pre it's something pretty unique, you know? I don't think it sounds really close to that melody. Um, I have that melody in here still. Yeah. So here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play the melody real quick. We're going to play the melody, the original melody, and then we're going to play what I flipped, the whole beat. So, And then that'll be the end of it. So yeah, if this shit helped you guys, make sure you leave a like and hit subscribe and use that new time because that new time is sauce, for real. Use that shit. All right. Much love, everybody. You stay safe out there. Peace.